Hi, so this is the Nexus 7 2012. I'm going to show you some of the button sequences to get into recovery mode. So you'll see in the back here, there's the power button and the two volume buttons. And I'm going to hold, press and hold the volume buttons, both of them. So I'm going to press and hold both of them, and I'm going to now press and hold the power button also. And I press and hold basically all three simultaneously. And uh, goes into this screen, which is called the bootloader screen. Now you'll see there's actually two arrow up and arrow down icons here. And I'm going to use the volume up and volume down to scroll. So I'm going to scroll to the recovery. And now the power button acts as a selection button. And I'm going to push that once. And now it's going to go take 10-15 seconds and boot into the recovery mode. And when it boots into recovery mode here, uh, there's another series of button sequences. And the button sequence is pushing the power button and the volume up button. So I'm going to push the power button here. And then I'm going to put the push the volume up button and I'm going to release. And this is the commands for the recovery mode. And the again, you're going to use the volume up and volume down buttons here to scroll. And the most common is to wipe out the partition cache or the cache partition. Uh, let me get focus here. So once you choose your choice, again, you're going to use the power button to do the selection. So I'm going to wipe the cache partition here. And you would want to do this. Sometimes the uh, booting goes into an endless loop and it never boots up. So that's a reason to wipe the cache partition. Another thing, uh, if you are really become desperate, is to just wipe the data and do a factory reset. Um, and then there's the choice to boot into basically the initial screen there, which is the bootloader and power down. But mainly, it's really for uh, going into the wipe partition cache. There's also a choice here where if, if you want to do an update uh, and not wait for the what is called the uh, OTA update, um, you could use this choice here. Um, but in general, uh, this is mainly for the white cache partition. And uh, th this is uh, one, one of the more useful buttons simply because at some point uh, during your booting of your uh, life of your Nexus, you might need to do this because it might boot into an endless loop either uh, during the updates when it downloaded something and it um, uh, sort of uh, you know, is in a bad state or something like that. All right. Uh, hope this helps and, uh, thank you for watching.